Hey guys, it's Kyle again, and this is the Forge Screen variant, the XRK Stalker in Modern Warfare 3. So we've got another Battle Pass variant. It's animated, it looks good. It's in Sector 13 of the Battle Pass. And yeah, we're just going to get into some gameplay. And as always, guys, if you are new around here, be sure to like and subscribe for more. This is my Stalker class. It's the one I made around the variant. Only thing that's changed aesthetically is the rear grip, but you can't even see it when you do the inspect, so it don't really matter. These are the perks I was using. And yeah, guys, enjoy the video. All right, so here's the variant right here. It's looking pretty good. You can see the purple part of it is animated. It kind of reminds me of Dark Matter. It's a lot more purple, though. Well, this is the second Stalker variant in a row that we've got on this sniper scope on. It's such a weird scope. I feel like this sniper scope is built for more long range. But yeah, what do you guys think of this variant? Everyone in this lobby is sitting somewhere, man. I don't think I've made it to their side of the map one time. That's how bad this is. Oh. Something I've literally just realised as well. I need to hit a clip with this. This sniper scope is not good for it. I need to hit a clip with this for quad feed with every battle pass variant. If it gets to the point where I can't even hit a clip with this scope on, that guy just got two kills so I wouldn't have even hit the clip. If it gets to the point where I can't hit the clip with this scope on, I'll just do hindsight or something. Regardless of what sniper scope you use, the stalker can feel so good. I'm hoping there's a ballista type sniper on Black Ops 6 as well. Okay guys, that's it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Like I always say, if you are new around here, be sure to like and subscribe for more. And I will see you on the next video.